As we head into summer, a reminder to put on sunscreen before you head out the door. An American Cancer Society report shows 100,000 people will be diagnosed with melanomas this year. And more than 8,000 will die from it. Mm. Now a revolutionary therapy is giving new hope to patients battling this deadly disease. TV5's Colette Boyd has the details. Steve Balzer spent day after day, year after year, outside working as an electric company lineman. Well, next thing I know, this, this lump's popping up. It's maybe as big as your thumb. Then he was diagnosed with stage 4 melanoma. Patients like Steve, surgery is the main option. Skin cancer has never responded to the older chemotherapies. In the last 10 years, we've seen dramatic advances with immunotherapies. But unfortunately, patients do... Uh, progress after a period of time. Now oncologist Ronan Kelly is one of the first to use a newly FDA approved TIL cellular therapy for patients with metastatic melanoma. It is a second generation immunotherapy. It's utilizing their own immune cells which have proven themselves to be stronger than their other immune cells. TIL cells are in immune cells that look for and attack cancer cells. This new therapy helps make a patient's TIL cells stronger so they can beat cancer. What we do is we take them from the tumor, we grow them in the laboratory, and we give them back as an infusion of their own strong immune cells to overwhelm the tumor. Dr. Kelly believes that it may soon be the first treatment to treat other solid tumors that have not responded to traditional treatments like surgery, radiation, and chemo. I'm Colette Boyd reporting. To cut your risk of getting melanoma, use sunscreen when you go outside and reapply it often. And the CDC recommends an SPF of 15 or higher. Also try to stay out of the sun from 9 in the morning to 3 in the afternoon. Those mm -hmm. UV rays tend to be the strongest. And if you have a lot of moles or moles that have abnormal shapes or colors, that can also put you at risk for melanoma.